Hi there guys, so apparently Tyson Fury could be facing an 8 year ban from boxing amidst reports that a farmer was paid 25 grand to keep hush hush and be an alibi for Tyson Fury to say that he ate a wild boar that was uncastrated and that was the reason why he had elevated levels of nandrolone in his system. Now that drug test came in 2015 and he later failed a drugs test in 2016 which was for cocaine which is obviously not a performance enhancing drug but the nandrolone thing was the big one but now obviously this would be a second offense although how can it be because he hasn't failed a drugs test obviously that refutes his alibi if that is true which i mean how much truth is there to it i mean why is he coming out now why didn't he come out before especially considering tyson fury is now wbc heavyweight world champion I've seen him more now on social media than I have ever, so he's more popular and famous than he has ever been. And the farmer waits until now to come out with this information, so it seems like it is timed very well. Also, the farmer gave his name. In these kind of reports, they very rarely give their name. And obviously, he had pictures taken on his farm as well. Again, something that very rarely happens in a case like this. Someone like him would normally want to remain anonymous. And perhaps that would mean that he doesn't get paid for his story. Whereas if he gives his name and has pictures taken, maybe he can sell the story. So I don't know what's going on with that, but it seems well-timed for this farmer to come out with this. But anyway, apparently that was part of Tyson Fury's alibi. And now he is saying that he lied and committed perjury. And that would mean apparently that Tyson Fury gets an eight-year ban from boxing, simply because there is no reason to explain why Tyson Fury had elevated levels of nandrolone in his system. guys. We don't know what's going on with this. We need more information, I think. And there needs to be a proper investigation into this farmer as well, because they can't just go on his word. They can't just say, take back his claims. And the fact that he produced an alibi for Tyson Fury, and that was untrue. We need to know more about this farmer himself. And we need to know his motivations. Obviously, he said that he was going to be paid 25,000. He said also he did not receive that. So there is no proof of funds. There is no proof that Tyson Fury and his team actually offered him that kind of money. I mean, that's kind of convenient as well, because if there was a money trail, then we know that Team Fury did pay him off. No money was transferred. So it's kind of convenient that he says he never received that money. So again, there is no money trail and it's just his word against Team Fury's. Anyway, guys, what are your thoughts on this? Apparently Tyson Fury could be facing an eight year ban after new reports that his team tried to pay off a farmer and give them a false alibi. Guys, drop your thoughts in the comments below. Click the thumbs up and subscribe if you are new. Thanks guys.